So a colleague of mine sent me um, this picture and asked me to comment on it. You know, because, of course, this is a New York Knicks basketball team and all of their players are married to white women. As a matter of fact, that has a black woman in the picture is actually a white dude, you know what I mean? But as far as the black players, they are all with white women. And um, I thought about it and I guess uh, my colleague expected me to go ham, you know what I mean, and try to be this activist who's gonna be like well i don't think that you know black people should be married to white women you know what i mean the money should be kept in the community and all of that and while some of that might be true like i am not against um people marrying outside of their races you know what i mean because if we are gonna say that we want equality you know what i mean equality means equality there is no compromise in equality you know, so if you want to be treated as equal human beings to everyone, then you should be able to marry whomever you want to marry. You know what I mean? If you want to think that you are inferior, then that is the only way that you are going to be pigeonholed to marry someone that is only of your race. You know what I mean? But once you consider yourself equal, then you should be able to date or marry whomever you feel like you want to marry. You know what I mean? So I don't, I'm not one of those person who is against, um, you know, crossbreeding, you know what I mean, or, or, you know, marrying or dating outside of your race. To me, that's total nonsense. Um, the feminists will tell you that they want equality and at the same time, they still want men to provide certain things for a woman you know what i mean which the woman wouldn't provide for the man had the shoes been on her feet you know what i mean and to me that is not equality because equality means anything i can do for you you can do the same for me you know what i mean and it's the same way i look at the situation if we as black people want equality you know what i mean then we should be able to date anyone we want to date without you know being scrutinized for it so if these men want to go and date black women or white women or indian women or chinese women mexican women latino whatever race they are arabs Arabs, whatever, how you pronounce it, if they want to date those people, they can do that. Same thing if white people want to date black men, they can do it if they want to. You know what I mean? Equality is equality. There are many more important things in the world to worry about than people who are, you know, having intercourse with certain people. You know what I mean? To me, this is not a pressing issue. And um, this is what I'd like to say. I know people like Dr. Umar, who I have a lot of respect for, you know what I mean? He's totally against interracial relationships, you know what I mean? You know, he feels that um, all races should stick to their own race, you know what I mean? But to me, that only creates more division you know i mean the whole topic of race will become more like religion and as you can see with religion where this man is saying i worship blue god this one is worshiping pink god that one is worshiping red god all it does is creates animosity and so i think integration is the best way everybody does integrate just be one race and that's the human race and treat others respectfully and people don't have to be like separating base and color creed class all that all that crap you know what i mean i don't think it makes sense as a matter of fact this is my weird concept <laughs> i think the only way to end racism is through the black man's lineage you know what i mean and listen to this entire concept so we as black people scientists have said that the black man is the first man so if the black man is the first man and the original man, based on what scientists have said, you can Google this, ladies and gentlemen. Therefore, the black man is the father or the black woman is the mother of all races. Therefore, all races are black. You know what I mean? You get the med the meds? If the black man and the black woman is the first people on earth, that means that all races came from us. Which means, then really and truly, there is only one race and that's the human race, despite having different colors. People have different colors, textures of hair and whatever because of where they are located and the environmental impacts on their bodies. You know what I mean? When you are in the United States as a black man and you live in a place like Wisconsin or, or which is very cold or... <clears throat> 
uh, you know what I mean, you will basically see your skin tone changing. Now imagine being living in that in those places for millions of years, thousands of years. If it eventually your body won't need the pigmentation, so you will lose it, you know. But my mad theory is this. In order to end racism, black people should be having sex with other races more because once, once a black person has sex with another race, then that child is going to be a black person. You know what I mean? It's not the reverse. When a white man gets a black woman pregnant, the child does not become white. The child is still black. You know what I mean? So in order to eliminate this entire black and white conversation or whatever, or Chinese, Asian, whatever, the black man should be having sex for his dear life. You know what I mean? We should basically be sexing all races, getting all of these women pregnant. You know what I mean? That is the only way we can end racism because that way we can use our dick to blackwash the entire human race. You get me? So that's the logic which I will see. Because, all right, for example, all of these black men in this picture right here, if they were supposed to get each of these white women pregnant, that's going to be one, two, three, four black kids. No white kids will be um, created from any of the unions above therefore if no white kids will be created from from any of the unions above therefore that definitely fixes the issue of racism because that will be all black kids you know what i mean so i encourage black men you know what i mean do not abandon your black women but make sure that you are getting some white women pregnant as well i'm out